हेलो एवरीवन नमस्ते अन्योन वेलकम टू द लेसन वन ऑफ लर्न कोरियन इजीली क्लियरली वी आर स्टार्टिंग लेसन वन नाउ इन लेसन वन वी विल हैव द इंट्रोडक्शन टू कोरियन लैंग्वेज introduction to korean language and that introduction is about the historical background as you can see on your screens the learning objectives the learning objectives of this lesson is about the hangul history brief history brief history who invented when invented and why invented Hangul. Hangul is the name of the Korean language script. Again, who invented, when invented, and why invented? When we are starting learning a new language, it is always good to know the historical background of that language. It will help us in the smooth learning and the fast learning and the clear learning. so let's go to the first point now can you see uh, on your screen yes name of the korean language script it is written in korean as you can see the all the letters and characters are very systematically arranged maybe you are feeling ah it is difficult to read no korean is very easy to learn and you can see it is written below hangul 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 is the name of Korean language script. I will request everyone to please write down this first. Fact that name of Korean language script is Hangul. First point is again, who invented Hangul? Hangul was invented by the fourth king of the Joseon dynasty, and the king name. you can see on your screen king sejong the great king sejong king sejong has invented hangul and at the time of the invention the hangul was known by the name of hun min jongam hun min jongam which literally means proper sounds for the instructions of the people proper sounds for the instructions of the people so please memorize this who invented korean language script hangul king sejong the great when it was invented it was invented in year 1443 it was invented in the year 1443 if you see the year it is not a very old language it is a very young and new language or one and it was open to general public on 9th october 1446 and on 9th october hangul day is celebrated in korea it is a national holiday and all over the world where korean language is available as a academic course or wherever there is a some community related to the korean language everyone celebrates hangul day hangul so the student asked this question so much that it was invented so many times this question comes it was invented in year 1443 and it was open to general public on in year 1446 so for these three years king sejong the great have done the trial of this language with his scholars inventors and the family members so again hangul day is celebrated on 9th october please memorize this also and third point is why invented it's a very natural question korea is having the history of the thousands of years in a country with thousands of years of history which language was used in korea before year 1443 yes you are right 
Korean was existing even before the year 1443, but only for speaking, speaking, and there was no script or letters for the Hangul. For writing and reading, Chinese characters were used, and at that time. only the elite class was able to learn the chinese and subsequently able to communicate in writing then what about the common people it was very difficult for the common people to learn the chinese characters at that time so seeing this inequality in the society king sejong decided to invent a new script which can be understood by the common people easily so again eurobon by it was invented because there was no letters for the korean language before year 1443 and chinese characters were used for writing and reading yes hangul is considered as one of the most scientific and the systematic language In the year 1997, UNESCO designated Hunmin Jeongum, Hunmin Jeongum, as a world heritage. Yes, and it's time for doing the self-assessment. What we have done in this lesson one? First, who invented Hangul? Answer is. king sejong we have to memorize these facts or even these are important facts and invented in year 1443 when open to public on 9th october 1446 coming to the next point why invented because there was no letters for the korean language and chinese characters were used at that time yes and today is the first day of learning korean so let's learn one word how to say hello hi how to greet someone in korean as you can see on your screens it is written in english annyeong ha seyo so you have to just memorize this word Annyeong ha se yo. Can we do practice together? Annyeong ha se yo. One more time. Annyeong ha se yo. Very good. One more time. Annyeong ha se yo. Well done. Char has so yo. Char has so yo means well done. So we are completing lesson one here, and in lesson two, we will learn about the Korean Hangul alphabet system. It will cover the introduction to the Hangul alphabet system, classification of the vowels and consonants, and the principle of formation of the vowels. See you in lesson two. Kamsa mida, kamsa mina. Meaning is thank you. Sugo hasha samida. See you in lesson two. Yorobun anyongi kese yo.